this shit contagious. Coming to you live from 844 Imports in Baltimore, Maryland. As you guys know, we just did a raffle here and the winner chose cash. So it's the first giveaway I did where the person actually chose the cash and didn't take the Jimny or Wagon R or today or one of the K-Vans. They want the cash and more power to you. I don't blame you for taking cash. Cash is definitely king. It was 7,500 bucks. But on my end, it left me kind of empty. It was like, all right, that's cool. I definitely would have took the cash too, I guess, if I didn't need a car but it left me a little empty and wanting to run it back. So I hit up Josh, I was like, let's brainstorm. Let's figure out a way where we can do another giveaway, but it's different, like more fair, I guess, lower the slots. That's why I put on Instagram, if you guys follow me on Instagram, I put like, would you guys mind if we did a raffle and we took away the free shipping? Cause the free shipping honestly is a big factor because if you live in the East coast, not that serious. Let's just say it costs, I don't know, 500 to a thousand. But if you live in California, I have to raise the slots more because that's probably gonna cost 2,000, 3,000, who knows, you know what I mean? So this one, we're gonna do no free shipping. It's gonna be $60 still, but only 150 slots. And it's gonna be five cars to choose from and four of them have a title, which is a very big pro. So first and foremost, we have this 1995 Honda Acti, four wheel drive. This guy was part of the last raffle as well. This one has the New Jersey title. So very good if you live in New York or somewhere where a title's a little more important to register your K car. Interior is pretty clean. It doesn't have floor mats. I'm not sure if they're inside his house or if they're somewhere else, but if you did pick this car and you didn't have floor mats, I definitely will order some for you from All Things JDM on my tab. You don't have to worry about that, but this one's pretty clean. Has 116,000 kilometers. I might drive this one today. Might drive it, I'm not sure yet actually. I kinda wanna drive this guy. And then right next to it we have, this is a 1996 Honda Street. This one has a double sunroof. A couple people asked me about this one as well. It has 233,000 kilometers. Definitely needs a nice detail, I'm not gonna lie, but that double sunroof, man. That double sunroof is very cool. Can't lie, and it has an ETC reader, which actually works. I started the car a couple seconds ago. Just to hear it and come on has a clock too which is nice ac five speed this one is two wheel drive I'll maybe drive this one in today's video this guy is not part of it this guy again is not part of it i think he said these are about to be sold this week so these are not part of it this mitsubishi is not part of it i'm not really sure the story about this guy maybe it's sold already maybe he's about to sell i think it's a dump no, nah, it's not a dump, but this one's not part of it either. And then let's work over to this side where we have a couple more cars that are part of it. The next car we have is a 1995 Honda Acti Street that is auto. This one needs a little something though, so I'm not gonna lie. This one is a maybe. It does have a Maryland title, which is a big pro, but it's leaking uh, brake fluid from here. So as you can see right there, it's a little messy, but it is an automatic, does have AC. I'm pretty sure it's also two wheel drive. This one's a bit cleaner as well. This guy's part of it. Josh said he's pretty sure he's gonna be able to fix it by the time the giveaway's over, unless this thing ends in like two days. But I guess I don't wanna say this is not part of it because I feel like someone's gonna be watching this and be like, for $60, I'll take it. I don't care about the brake fluid. And if that's you, then more power to you. But this one is part of it though. We just gotta get that fixed first because I don't really wanna give someone a car where they have to worry about putting money into it and stuff like that. Even though it's $60, I still feel like I'd rather give you a completely running car like this Honda today, which is also part of it. This one is the only one that's part of the giveaway that does not have a title. He actually just got this in. This one only has import papers. It's actually my first time seeing one of these too. Let me sit in here. It's a little dusty. Give it a nice detail, but it's a four speed, which I'm not crazy about, but it's pretty nice. It has 30,000 kilometers, and I'm pretty sure it's 130. Interior is a little dusty, but it's not dirty. Back seats are pretty clean, which you can expect in a car like this. I doubt anybody sat back there. Headliner's not too bad either. This, this one this one just needs a, definitely a deep vacuum. He just got it though, like I mentioned. I'll make sure this thing is nice and detailed if the winner chooses this guy. 
I was gonna say, what's this, a Honda Acti exhaust? But this guy's not part of it either. Um, this Acti is not part of it either. I think he's still working on that. The Wagon R is on eBay right now. I'll put the link in the description if anybody wants that. That's on there. That might sell for like four or five Gs. And then the last car that's part of it is this Suzuki Jimny that you guys saw last time as well. This one's an automatic, power windows, 154,000 kilometers. Not too bad, not too bad. All right, so I'm here with the main man, Josh. What's going on? We're man? gonna go over his complete inventory right now. I gotta give you guys a quick little speed run, but he'll tell you like what plugs have been changed, what comes with the car and stuff like that. So we're gonna start with the Acti. Yeah, we'll start with the Acti. All right, cool. Um, so it was a 95. 95. Uh, Real-time four-wheel drive. It'll come with uh, plugs, wires, cap rotor, uh, new air filter, and uh, oil change and oil filter. Obviously. Yeah. Okay. Cool. And it'll check all tire pressure before it loads anywhere if it leaves. Yeah. And uh, you know, if not, it'll be marketed locally. Yeah. And like I mentioned earlier, this one will have floor mats. Like you don't have to worry about that. The bed's pretty clean too. Has a battery cover, which I know people love. I might maybe drive this one today and then these two are no this one is part of the giveaway this one's part of the giveaway right. so this one's a 96 that one's a 96 okay this one we spoke about a little bit it needs a nice little detail but yeah so this one we'll get a full detail done you know how the smokers are in japan yeah Apparently they, this is like a like a hot box or something yeah no know. this one someone definitely yeah. smoked in it's cool it has a double sunroof though yeah uh the same thing this one will come with uh full tune up when are these speakers yeah, these are speakers. Oh, wow, that's um, nice. They were mounted on a rack or on the sides right here. Kind of funky how they're in there. there. Yeah. Um, it has an aftermarket radio. I don't know how, if it reaches the same uh, frequency. It came with this little broom, too? Yeah, you believe that? JDM wow. broom. <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah, and I guess, I think this might have been something to sell stuff for. Like, you see this right here? Maybe they were hanging yeah. stuff up or... Even this is like a like little hat rack or something. Yeah. So, I would, maybe... Yeah, this one's probably put to work. Went to yeah. a market or something and, you know, open up shop. So this guy's a 96. This one's two-wheel drive, right? Two-wheel drive. Five-speed, has a clock, has the ETC reader, which is cool. And then these two are for sale, not part of the giveaway. Right, not part of the giveaway. Uh, just because while I was away, there were some folks that were interested in them. And, yeah. And uh, I kind of held off because of the giveaway, so I want to entertain a little bit of that crowd. Um, yeah. And if not, we probably do something at a later date. For yeah. These two. I mean, do you want to say like what these were price like with the price? If well, anybody right does want, no one doesn't want to give away and just want to be part. I got of. these prices at seventy nine hundred each. Okay. Um, I think they both share their pros and cons. This was a ninety one. That was the ninety five. Uh, they're both two wheel drive. This one has those JDM wheels. Yeah, the nice wheels. Brand, brand, new, brand tires. new tires. Um. But uh, other than the smaller headlights, um, this one has a smaller one. That one has the bigger one. They're both HH3 models. So yeah, these are cool. I drove this one. It was actually pretty peppy because it was two-wheel drive. I was actually thinking about maybe hitting it with a mirror tint to see how it would contrast a yeah. little bit. But I said, you know what? Let me hold off on a little bit because if I do that, I might want to drive. For yeah, a bit. I like this then, one. Yeah, then it kind of just delays the sale because you kind of get attached a little yeah. bit to them. So. No, I, li I like both of them, honestly. Yeah, I like these good. wheels. This is how I wish that my Jimny looked, honestly. Oh, I was meant. Bumper. Yeah, the front bumper, the roof rack. Power windows was nice, too. Yeah, you see that? I think it's like a universal kit that you can add to yeah. vehicles in Japan. But, um... Uh, this one's a 95? This one's a 95. Maryland title. Maryland title, Land Venture Edition. And the more I'm looking at these, I think it's primarily the color, the color scheme that they that they utilize to brand it uh land venture yeah but um this one's automatic four by four as usual locking hubs yeah uh, has the nice rack on the top the cover on the last one i had i actually had ordered a cover but it was nice to see that this one came with one um for the back area it doesn't have the flex like yours had yeah i know so a lot of people are asking about those seats i didn't know it was that like special yeah so it's actually a rack that they put in the back where you can adjust how the yeah because like this is almost not possible for an adult to yeah. see yeah but with my seats they went like all the way back here and you could actually adjust yours forward and back yeah. and then flip it all up yeah this one's cool i mean the one i have was really yeah cool. i have no th no idea what these are but i can imagine maybe an antenna or a, yeah like something or a, radio or alarm or something at one point nice jimny you have another one coming in too i'm gonna post a picture of it i might buy it though so i don't yeah. know about you guys yeah that one's pretty cool uh this one's on ebay i mentioned that so i'll put the link in the description if anybody wants that guy this one is not for sale this guy you just got in. Uh, this is a 91 uh, Honda today. This has the same motor as these guys? 
the EO7, a three cylinder. So, same thing. I'll pop the hood real quick, show you. So, basically, it's pretty clean. Oh, yeah. Same thing that I see on the regular Acti trucks, except for the way that the distributor is mounted. Uh, so, typically, you will see this mounted sideways, and you will be seeing the cap more just attached to the side of the motor. Did you change this already? No, no, this oh, came uh, the way you it see came it. came clean. Yeah, I was just going. I, I like to go through them and uh, see how the plugs look, the cap, the rotor. I mean, it may be good, but sometimes, you know, for the cost, it's still worth replacing. Yeah, this is my first time seeing one of these. Yeah, this one actually has AC that works, which is surprising oh, for wow. a '91. So I saw it's a four-speed. Four it's pretty big too for like. It's small, but like if you put the seats down, you don't have a lot of space. Right. Then you can appreciate the cargo. Space. Yeah, the cargo is really good. Yep. Has a nice like old look to it. Yeah, I don't know. I was looking at it. I was wondering if some SIs would fit in here, but I don't think we got that much clearance for some 15-inch wheels. Yeah, nah. Maybe 13s, tops, 14s with a yeah. little small tire. But uh, these two were out of the question for now, just because they're going through some work that we got to get done. And then the uh, the green. Uh, yeah, this one we spoke about a little bit. This one's automatic. Uh, it's a 95. It does have a title. Uh, just recently, it developed a leak right behind the steering column. From what I think is like the brake. Uh, the brake line that goes from the reservoir uh that connects to that main hub for the master cylinder so if we get that taken care of this week it, it could be part of the raffle yeah i know someone's watching this video though and they don't care about that and they're gonna be like i want it for 60 dollars, which i mentioned too right like, i won't say no to it but i just feel like it makes more sense to take a car that's already running right but to each his own the winner gets to choose I just know that if I got to order something from Japan minimum a week or two, yeah. so let's just say that the, the raffle closes out in a week, yeah. there's no way I would have something in time to yeah. order and get that done. But with patience, everything could be done. So if we network and this is the one somebody would like and yeah. understand in that situation, we could definitely work something out as well. This one's cool too. It's pretty clean. I like the color. I feel like I don't really see them in this green. Yeah, the, the more. The, I say the... The thing that I least uh, like about them is the fade. So I don't know how hot that sun is. Yeah, no, I, I don't, my van, I'm so lucky, doesn't have any sun fade. <laughs> yeah, but 99% of them. Isn't that it's wild? not an acting thing. It's just every van I've yeah. ever seen. I think they just sit out there. And the, and the Jimmy you had as well. Like a, yeah, the it's, yeah. The roof Even the Wagon R, kind of. Silver. Yeah, that one. Like, it's I like. I think that one sat for such a long time. Yeah. I don't really understand. Like, the sides are always so perfect. And then just over here has a sun fade. But it's also like 25 row paint. Right. What you really expect. But I guess I'll end this video here. This is the recap one more time. We have the Jimny, the Honda Today, the Acti if somebody wants, the double sunroof Acti, and then the four wheel drive Honda K truck. So if you're watching this video, get yourself a slot. 60 slots, $60 each slot, 150 total, no free shipping. But hopefully that way it makes everyone's life a little easier. I get to meet one of you guys. Someone picks one of these trucks. And it'll be a cool little video. Peace out.